All right. Hello, chat. Good news. I found a way to display the chat during members only streams. Now this looks completely the same as any other stream, because we have the chat now on the screen. Hello. Hello, J-Rex. Hello, Dylan. Hello, Devin. Hello, Fugi. How we doing, Fugi? Hello, Irene. The Baguette. T-Seg. Hello, Turtle King. Hey, Tigera. How you doing? Hey, Alucara. Beyond the Cartoon. Hey, Mind Max. Hey, Dior. Hey, John Carlos. Hey, TV Vod. Hey, Kage. Hey, Sozi. Hey, hey Nick, how you doing? Glad to see you on the chat, buddy. Hey XX, hey Mr. Haunted, Pablo the Cad, Coca Cody, Banana Boy, Glitch Karma, Mr. Haunted, Egg, Evil Nutella, I still can't get over that name. Hey Marinette, how's it? How's everyone go doing so far? I'm doing pretty well. Welcome to the Analog Horror After Party. Hey, definitely not a robot. Hey, Wicklord, Domino Head, Alex, as Daf Dead as 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 the 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 Dafkin. Yes, welcome to the Analog Horror After Party. Is Kako dead? Oh yeah, he is a uh, he is uh, a bit sleepy right now, so uh, he's not gonna be part of the stream. It's okay. I told him to take a rest because like he was visibly like actually tired and I don't want to put people through streams while they're like massively tired and without any sleep. Yes, and I killed them personally. Also, yes, uh, Tigera stabbed them in the back. It's okay though. Uh, though, I guess that means that I won't have anyone to play these spooky games with. Speaking of which, we should probably explain to the chat what this stream is going to be like. This is gonna be a very important, boys. Cause... Do you remember the last after party? You know how we played FNAF games? Uh, like a bunch of FNAF fan games in the after party. And we had to pick them using a wheel? Well... Right now, the wheel is back. And we have exactly eight games that we could, and I don't, I mean could, play. I'm not going to be playing all of these, but these are all the possible games that we're going to be playing in the after party. And you might think, hey, Phil, well, last time you did this, you kind of put a little bit of a, a little bit of a, some danger into the situation by, like, adding a drink counter. Whenever you died in one of these games, you drank and moved on to the next one. Are you really gonna do a drinking stream with only eight games? No! Because drinking too much too often is a bad idea. You can't... Please make sure to not drink too often. It's only for special occasions. But you know what I did have, though? As a, as a, as a danger element to the stream, I put something very particular on this list. What up, Phil? What up, Big Chunky? I put a certain little game called Inunaki Tunnel. Now, for those that don't know what Inunaki Tunnel is, this motherfucking thing was gifted to me by Kako a few years ago. And as you can see here, I only managed to get an hour into it. Less than an hour. I don't know why I don't know why this says an hour. I only played this for like a few minutes. And I couldn't finish it. I could not fucking finish it. Cause this thing is literally out of my fucking nightmares. Look at that! Already just seeing that image! Makes me like tense up. So yes, uh, one of the games that we might play today is Inunaki Tunnel. Uh, the rest of the games are Scary Tales Volume One, The Building Seventy One Incident, Unsorted VHS, Non Massacre, Anatomy, Lure, uh, No Players Online, and finally Inunaki Tunnel. 
and we have to play five out of eight of these games. Each of these games are very small. They wouldn't work for a full stream. They are about 30 to 45 minutes long each. So that's why they aren't in an after party. They're a bundle of games that we are going to play. Maybe. Who knows? I hope. I really fucking hope that I don't get to do Inunaki Tunnel today. But, you know, it's like Russian roulette. You know? It's... You you have that danger that it might Inunaki Tunnel might pop up at any point during this stream. And that's basically the explanation for what we're going to be doing today. Isn't that nice? Fucking just put it just putting the gun barrel to my head and just spitting it! Just spitting it! Just in case. Just to add a little bit of like tension to the stream. Uh, Phil, no! It's okay, Fugi. The adrenaline keeps me going. Phil, you're torturing yourself, bro. Yeah, but that's for fun! It's Halloween! It's in the Halloween spirit! You're supposed to be scared of what- of doing Halloween-y stuff. Oh, that's so nice. Don't die on us, Phil, though. It's okay. Let's see if you guys will finally experience me finishing that game for the first time on stream. All right, everybody ready to start this after party? Cause I have all the games installed, and we can just start right away if we, if you want to. Let's go. Yes, ready. All right, ready. Yes. All right. Okay. For the first game in our list, we are going to be playing. Oh God! 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 Uh. <laughs> For like a second, I thought it was going to be it. Yeah! Anatomy! Almost! I really like this game. I'm so glad that it, that it popped up. Uh, you guys are gonna have fun with this one. This one is spooky as fuck. Let's go. Alright. Let me set up the game. Holy shit. <laughs> Almost. So, Anatomy is a game where you are inside a house. And the description of it doesn't say much. It just says, Every ha house is haunted. Can you guess why? Let me pull up the game right now. It's opening up. Actually, maybe I can just display it on stream like this. There we go. This is going to make this much, much easier. 1920 by 1080. Graphics lo-fi. Display on the right, please. Can't be here for the stream because I have to drive four hours, but I wanted to say hi. Hi, Starry! Thank you! Thank you for the donation. This one is really a really solid game. Hell yeah, Nia. It's always the demons. You know that it's analog horror when the game starts with a VHS sound. God. I remember playing this one at, like years ago. Do I still remember, like, where to go in this house? Oh, it starts right away? Yeah. It- these are- these games are very to the point. That spin was way too close, you're playing with fire. That's the point of this stream. Playing spooky games with a- with a risk. What do you got? Wait, anatomy like in biology? Yes! Though I don't think this game has a very understandable point to biology. In the psychology of the modern civilized human being, it is difficult to overstate the significance of the house. Since as early as the Neolithic era, humankind has defined itself by its buildings. Buildings for worship, buildings for socializing, buildings for protection, even buildings for the commemoration of the dead. But of all the structures that mankind has invented for itself, 
there is little doubt that the house is that which it relies upon most completely for its continued survival. There's a tape in the dining room. This might not be very scary for me, because I already played this game, and I know the threats that are gonna appear. But... I need you- I need you guys to listen to the, this game. If I complained before about how the Mandela catalog has a lot of nothing going on, this is gonna be the opposite for, the, for this stream, like... This game, like, builds atmosphere fucking masterfully. Home is not safe. Oh, this home isn't fucking safe for sure. Watch out for the paintings. Is the house the eval? I don't know what that means. Listen to this. Phil, did you see the teaser for the Mandela Catalog 4 that Alex posted? Yes, I did! I really like the Windows XP, like, chat room, uh, portion of it. I'll check it out. I'll check out, uh, 4 when it comes out. The house is one of the key elements that separates modern humanity from its more primitive antecedents. No other creature goes to such lengths to create lasting, permanent shelter for itself, nor regards such shelters with such reverence and import. Why do human beings of our modern age foster this tremendous sympathy toward their homes? There are many reasons, of course, but perhaps it is due in some small part to seeing them as a reflection of ourselves. Ugh, gives me shivers every time. Hey, Degon. Gonna play that tunnel game that you hate and one of your old games for the Halloween week, Phil. Just for, Just the, for thrill. the thrill. Thank you, Degon. There's a tape in the downstairs bathroom. I think that said it. It said that. Can I glitch out this door? Yes, I can! Hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> Fucking Unity games. I can still- I, I, I can do that, but I can't do much besides that. You're already trying to break the game? Uh, I mean... It's gonna be that hard to break this game. I don't want to, though, because the atmosphere for this is, like, masterful. The anatomy of the house is such that this analogy is less superficial than at first it may seem. To carry it further, if we were to dissect a house as we might a human cadaver, we would find ourselves able to isolate and describe its various appendages and their functions in a decidedly anatomical fashion. There is even a fair number of direct comparisons to be drawn between those organs of the house and those of the human body. Uh. There's a tape in the garage. Nope, don't want to go in there. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ. Go, just go. Just go, just go, just go, just go, just go. <laughs> For example, let us examine the living room. Often the dominant space of the house is ground level, as well as typically the center of activity. The silence is worse. Home. The living room is very much the heart of the house. While a human heart circulates blood to oxygenate the body's extremities, the living room circulates people, activity, communication. It is the room most likely to be found beating, as active and vivacious as its name would imply. The comparison is only strengthened when we consider also that the living room is most commonly the room to contain the fireplace, making it additionally a locus of actual physical heat. There's a tape in the living room! <laughs> oh boy, like, the dude is like slowly describing each element of this house. 
slowly but surely introducing you to the concept of the anatomy of the house. And then after each tape, it tells you to go to those places. I said he describes in detail how the circulation and like... It is easy Fuck. to look at the kitchen and dining room as the stomach or digestive system of a house, though this comparison is tenuous. By contrast, the function and analog of a bathroom should be immediately obvious. The hallways and corridors of the house are its veins, providing circulation coursing throughout its frame. A staircase bears more than a passing resemblance, both physically and symbolically, Thoughts to the sign. The walls. Oh, the windows Scott is great. Serve much the same Thank purpose you, as eyes, and anyone who has ever rounded a bend or a long drive and come suddenly face to face with a tall, dark manor will tell you that it is difficult to shake the impression that the house, through its lightless windows, is a creature capable of vision and intelligence. <laughs> There's a tape on the stairs! Uh, Scott the Woz is amazing. I love his show. Yeah, I used to watch him from time to time, when I had more time. So is this about picking tapes up while getting spooked? Kind of. The atmosphere is fucking great, though. The bedroom is perhaps the room that most eludes direct comparison in this fashion. At a stretch, and allowing for a bit of poetic... Stay away from the stairs. ...it might be said that the bedroom is not unlike the human mind, or those parts of it which dictate thought and imagination. In the bedroom, dreams are dreamt, passions are ignited, epiphanies are experienced in cold sweat at early hours. In the bedroom is where people invariably spend the majority of their time, though comparatively little of it whilst conscious. Yeah. <laughs> There's a tape in the bedroom. And did you hear that lock, that unlock fucking sound in the distance? Jesus Christ, I was so fucking terrified of this game. Oh, by the way, do you wanna do you wanna hear some spooky shit? Do you wanna hear some spooky shit? Do you wanna do you wanna get your fucking like you, you know when you're like, oh, it's not open. That'll be for later. Shit. Shit. Don't worry, you're gonna- you're gonna get spooked in a second. Shit is fucked. Uh. Yeah, the- the- the doors of this house, like, open up slowly more and more as you pick up the tapes. It's a spooky month! And yet, this analogy is an incomplete one. For obviously the mind is an exceedingly complex thing. If the bedroom represents the thinking, dreaming part of the brain, then it is the basement that represents those lower, unconscious parts. The basement is dark. It is buried. It is a place full of cobwebs where memories are stored. A poignant comparison, truly. Often the unnerving uncertainty that comes with considering the deeper aspects of the human psyche is not unlike gazing down at the swimming blackness pooled at the bottom of a basement stairwell. Oh, no. It is a place we spend our childhoods filling with monsters that will lay for years in patience. Oh. <laughs> it is a place that, barring some specific errand, we seldom ever want to go. <laughs> I have to go to the fucking basement now? Yeah, he, he, he hyped it up so fucking hard. Now I have to go to the basement. <sighs> All right, let's go. Oh, it's just fucking pitch black darkness. Just grab it. Just grab it. Fucking go. Just grab it and fucking go. Just grab it and go. Fuck. Fuck. Just grab it and go, just grab it and go. Of course, this comparison, though appropriate, is a very heavy-handed one. And often the basement is little more than a storage space littered with the Motherfucker. Of spiders and wood. <laughs> Poets and psychoanalysts no doubt dread the thought of a dark basement. In truth, 
It is the bedroom, the waking mind, that place of dreams. He soon the most frightening of all. Just type in the master bedroom. Ooga booga! Ooga booga. Thank you, D. All right, time to go here. Now, this shit fucking makes my skin crawl like nothing else in the world. Is this the one? No, this is the master bedroom. Shit. All right, this thing fucking makes my skin crawl. If you want to do quiet, but like disturbing horror rights, this is the poster child for it. It is here, in the bedroom, that we are at our most vulnerable. Each night we shut our senses to the world for hours at a time, trusting in the house to keep us safe until next we wake. In this state of extreme vulnerability, we will spend something like 20% of our lives. Anything might stand beside us, watch us, keep us company until dawn, and we would never perceive it. We can only pray that the house will not let such things carry on as we sleep. In this way, during these hours, the bedroom seems less like a mind and more like a mouth. For it is here that the house is most likely to betray us. It is here that we place ourselves most at the house's mercy and spend each night hoping that it will not bite down. <laughs> Ah, the game crashed. <laughs> Fucking love it. Now. You think it's over? <laughs> Cause it's not. You thought that was it? No, game crash? No, 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 that was on purpose. That was a hundred percent on purpose. We going back in. Thoughts on Scott the Wars? Oh, pretty good. Thank you, Kix. Thank, uh, thank you for asking again. You, you got a little bit of a 7 on your message there. Not done trick-or-treating yet! The Unity logo does kind of ruin the tension, though. But still. Here we go! Round 2, motherfuckers! Nineteen ninety four. Do you notice anything different? In the psychology of the modern civilized human being, it is difficult to overstate the significance of the house. Since as early as the monastic era, humankind has defined the era of God. The various structures that mankind has invented for itself, there is little doubt that the house is that which I'm tired of this grandpa. <laughs> I want to go to bed. <laughs> Alright, we need to do uh, the very tape in dining room. Yep, that that wasn't interactable before. Yep, no, thank you. Yep, no, no, no. Give me that. No, that's not it. Oh, it's all open now. I didn't notice that before. All doors are open now. Wait! If all, if all doors are open now, that means I can show you guys the thing. Oh god, here we go. Just ignore that, like, clipping, fucking, destroyed window, by the way. <laughs> just ignore that. Let's just go get the tape. It's all good, don't worry about it. 
I don't like that. <laughs> I didn't like it either, motherfucker. Let's just go. Let's just go. Hey guys, I'm back. What did I miss? There's a tape in downstairs bathroom. Just go, just go, just go, just go, just go, just go. Oh yeah, that 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 mirror is like acting a little bit fucked up. Don't worry about that. Don't worry about that one. It's all good. The all doors are unlocked. I forgot where the other tape was. Shit, I forgot where it was the garage. Oh no, I was here. Living room. It was not here. Uh yeah, I kinda need to hurry up with this. Uh otherwise bad shit might start happening. Where's the other tape? The other tape. Uh bedroom. No. Garage. Uh shit. Does anybody remember, uh, what the other fucking tape was? Maybe the bedroom. Basement? No! <laughs> Not the basement. Ah, oh, fuck, here we go. Yeah, we need to find that tape really quickly. There we go. Just, ign just ignore the tendrils. Just ignore the tendrils. It's alright, it's all good. Just get the fuck in there. Noise too. Tip in the living room. Nothing spooky is gonna happen in the living room. Fuck out of here. Yeah, look, that tape's it's got a uh, funny looking. Woo! As long as I'm in a corner, I'm safe. It is easy to think of the kitchen and dining room as a stomach or digestive system that is compiled for this tenure. By contrast, the function and analog of a bathroom should be immediately obvious. The higher rows and corridors of a house are in vain, providing circulation. The walls are gonna grab you, Phil. <laughs> you know, considering this house, it fucking might. The windows of the house serve much the same purpose as eyes. Uh. Right? Absolutely no fucking instructions. Just go off of memory. Hey, Kako. Yeah, this is anatomy. I think the te next tape was like here. Welcome, Gakko. Shit, I forget where the tapes are. Ooh. I hated that. That was awesome. Yeah, this game is like that. Uh. I hate fucking running around this fucking house. Wait. Did I have to go to the basement? 
No. Okay, thank God. Leave the master bedroom? Oh, God. Okay, yeah, that master bedroom. Got it. This, this was not here before. By the way, I love that you can actually, like, see where the tapes are, like, because they have, like, light, like, being, like, projecting out of its mesh. The bedroom is perhaps the room that most eludes direct comparison in this fashion. At a stretch, and allowing for a bit of poetic sympathy, it might be said that the bedroom is not unlike the human mind, or those parts of it which dictate thought and imagination. In the bedroom, Joe, 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 his body is covered in swollen ticks the size of horrors. He's walking through the downstairs hallway and laughing. He begins urinating on the wall. He spits on the carpet. He's moving through the first floor, breaking and upsetting things. He goes to the basement and stands at the top of the stairs. I'm angry at him, so I slam the door and he falls down. I can feel his bones snapping. The texts are bursting, losing all black blood everywhere. I can feel them being ground out, dissolved and torn, splitting and shredding. I leave the door closed. I close my eyes and try to sleep. The teeth continue growing on me until there is nothing left of me but teeth. The basement is dark. <laughs> Let's go to the basement. If you didn't actually understand what that story was. That was the story of a drunk that came home one late night and stumbled into the basement stairs. Something closed the door behind him. That drunk emote was foreshadowing? Yeah, you thought it was a fucking mistake? Did an Omori reference. Alright. That was not anatomy. We have one more to go. Third go ahead, boys. One more try. Just a single one more try. Third time's the charm! This one's gonna be different. Yeah! <laughs> yeah! Yeah! Get hyped! That's an actual picture of a corpse, by the way. Well, it's, uh... It's being dissected, and it, it's from, like, the... Like, the fucking 1800s, but still. Yeah! <laughs> yeah! Uh, does anybody want gonna gonna wanna wanna go watch TV? Yeah, <laughs> you'll never come back. Let's go get that fucking tape. Yep, 
This place is cursed! I hate this channel. Oh boy, there's not even a refrigerator on anything anymore. Yeah, that, that sure's having some fun. Let's get the fuck out of here. How are we gonna eat now? Yeah, we don't have instructions now. We just have to go. We, we just have to go. Just fucking go. Just speed run this shit. Just speed run this shit. Music to my ears. Yeah, whatever. Uh, fucking bathroom. So I better remember the locations of the tapes, cause like this is important. The house is awakened. Uh, I think uh, something else is going on. I, I think uh, I don't think this is awake. Yup. Shit. Uh, where's the other one? Shit. Yeah, that's the that's the entrance, by the way. Yeah, we're not leaving this shit. Uh, not dining room, not bathroom. We can't open this one. Fucking bedroom? No! Shit. Yeah! Fleshy, fleshy, fleshy! No, thank you! <laughs> Give me that shit! It's still screaming. Imagine leaving the game the first round and thinking that was it. <laughs> Fucking whatever the other place is, let's go. Uh, here? No. No, not there. Uh, living room. Yes. Get away from the spooky red fucking whatever the fuck. What in biology is this? <laughs> the ghost is literally living in your walls this time. It's a bit more complicated than that. Down into the basement we go. There is an important distinction that must be drawn between the words deception and vivisection. A distinction that would appear to be lost on you. Your purpose was to listen, and yet at every turn you have pride, you have prodded, and you have interfered. Have you not been paying attention? Did it not occur to you that as an organism existing within a greater organism, your intrusion would be felt? And still you harassed. And now, like the wayward spider who witlessly settles upon a sleeper's tongue, you will be swallowed. Because the truth is this. When a house is both hungry and awake, every room becomes a mouse. Oh, I love this guy's voice acting. Oh, this is a new one. This is a new ending. I never got this ending. I don't know what this one is. It's completely different from the first time I played this. Are these houses being built? Yeah, these are like... These are like pillars, bases for like different houses that are gonna be built in the future. 
And they have some fleshy shit on them already. Multi-ending game? Yes. It's completely random what ending you get. I think this is implying that the base use for these houses have, like, this weird fleshy material on them. I think that for the second game, you should do a second wheel with the game that won the first wheel. An Inunaki Tunnel, you know, just to spice things up a little bit. <laughs> Thank you, Nick. Oh my fucking god. Okay, that's a finished house at least. I think actually this is the house that we were in before. Yes, it is. This is the house from the outside. Uh, hopefully, um, if I open this up once again, I'm gonna get the ending that I want, because there is a specific ending that I want you guys to see before we move on to something else. Because this shit, this shit, if we manage to get what I'm about to show right now, this shit, like, kept me up, like, awake during a night. There's a reason I put this game in here. Because I want people to, like, listen to this. Just listen to this. Maybe. Let's see if we can get it. Yes! This is not a fourth run. This is the epilogue, essentially. I Maybe it won't be, like, very listenable on the stream, but I'm gonna keep quiet because this is... This is... This narration is, like, sent fucking chill... What happens to a house when it is left alone? When it becomes worn and aged? When its paint peels? When its foundations begin to sink? When it goes for too long unlived in? What does it think of? What does it dream? How does it regard those creatures who built it? Died into existence only to abandon it? When its usefulness no longer satisfies them? It may grow lonesome. It may stare for long hours into the darkness in its own empty halls and see shadows. And its heart may jump as it thinks, Here, here is someone again, I'm not alone. And each time it is wrong. And the heart starts over. It may find itself inventing ghosts to walk its floor, making friends with its shadow puppets, laughing and whispering to itself at the end of some quiet cul de sac. It may grow angry. Its basement may fill with churning acid like an empty stomach, and its gorge may rise as it asks itself through clenched teeth, what did I do wrong? It may grow bitter. It may grow hungry. So hungry and so bitter that its scruples dissolve and its doors unlock themselves. While a house may hunger, it cannot starve. And so, in fever and anger and loneliness, it may simply lie in wait. Doors open. Shades drawn. Hallways empty. Hungry. Yeah! Uh, holy shit.
shit. And that's anatomy. Jesus Christ. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> So, if anybody, uh, complained to me that I did, uh, I need to, like, have constant stimulation going on for me to be entertained by a game, or, like, a, or, like, a video, like, for the people that, uh, thought that I had the attention span of a mayfly for the, the Mandela catalog, this is how you do quiet horror rights. I fucking pissed my fucking pants when I first played this game. So I put this here on the list just to show people like a fraction of how I felt when I originally played this. The concept of living houses that through being abandoned make up ghosts and eventually become like creatures that like, attempt to eat the people that go inside, like fucking, like, Venus flytraps, is so fucking terrifying! I fucking love this developer. There wasn't any actual, like, like, there wasn't any actual threat or, like, monster in it, it was just the house, but it still puts you in the edge of our seat just because of how good the narration is. It's so fucking cool! Alright, uh... That that was kind of a special uh that, that was kind of a special game on the on the stream because uh I haven't played any of the other ones. That was just the one that I played and wanted to share on the chat with everybody. I am so glad that was the first option. Uh hell yeah! One game out of five down. Life is busy at the moment, but your streams are a nice break in between. Thank you for that, Phil. No problem, boy! Hopefully you you enjoyed anatomy. All right, one down, four more to go. Now Inunaki Tunnel. Now it's time for me. Are you saying it's now time for me to be scared, Banana Boy? See, we'll see, we'll see. Let's spin the wheel. <laughs> <laughs> Aye! Non massacre. Oh god, this one is loud. Oh god, a fucking puppet combo game. All right. Puppet combo games are notoriously fucking loud. So everybody plug your fucking ears when the jump scare happens. Let's go. Phil slightly pisses himself every time the wheel shows up. Yeah, those are the scariest parts of this stream. All right. English, please. Accept. Holy shit, how did I predict that? Please adjust that we're uh, just tracking for best quality picture. Thank you. I have not played this one, but I know that Puppet Combo games are... ...a mixed bag. I only remember this because Vine Soul... Vine Soul's Joel played it. Hey! I love Joel! Ratalkaika Games. Games by... Loom. Something, something. Non massacre. Let the. Oh my god, there's a volume for the nun. Good. Hmm. Tig let there's a toggle for jump scares. That's lovely. Hold on a second. This game is very loud. This stream should be watched in 144p. Actually, yeah, let's go to the advanced settings. V-Sync, Gamma, Frame Rate. Let's turn that shit up. Oh, it's unstable. Okay, it's fine. Like, we'll go to 30 FPS, it's fine.
play scenario, select scenario. There's different scenarios for this? None. Question mark, question mark, question mark. Oh, there's different stuff in here. Randomized item locations? No. Difficulty... Easy. None moves slower. None is slower to react. None will patrol the halls less. More first and eight kids and more bullets in the gun. Yes. I don't need to... I, I don't need... I don't need to get, like, uh, frustrated on the stream. No, thank you. Non-massacre. Stealth chart. The no Fuck. It looks like she can't find the bathroom. What is this? Can I move out of here? I love suffering. <laughs> Where? Is she gonna appear over here? Get out? Should I? Should I get out? certainly is an after party. Certainly nothing wrong is gonna happen. Maybe close this door. What the fuck? Oh, the movement is so weird. And there's no way to turn off the 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 head bobbing movement. What the fuck? Oh, never mind. A letter. Dear Miss Donnell, I hope this letter finds you well. Your child is sick and needs your immediate attention. We would normally handle this matter- WHAT?! Idiot. Let me read the letter again. We would normally handle this matter, but the situation is urgent, as we do not have telephone service. You will need to appear in person. In the peace of Christ, Mother Apollonia. Right? Why are we outside? That's a great question. Go home? Fuck it! I can't go back. Well, why did you even ask me? How the hell did you drive your fucking car in here? Ooh, this is the mountains. A car from the 80s. Are you sure you're not the nun? You just teleported. I am... Mrs. Someone Someone. Jesus Christ, this road is rocky. Hey everyone, welcome to Hiking Simulator! Pretty sure it's gonna turn into another kind of game real fast. Unless this is literally just Hiking Simulator. The UVs on this mountain are just. Mwah! Mwah! Bro's gonna. This bro's not wearing any clothes, he's gonna get pneumonia. Maybe- okay, you don't know him, maybe he has a fucking raincoat on. 
judgment judgmental much. This is such a nonsense. Look, like, where the fuck are we going? Move. The non massacre. Fucking eighties music and intro. Well, what what do you want me to do, puppet combo? Do you want me to just jump off a cliff? Music by Luna. Written by Leela Amareth and Edward W. Do a flip. I'm afraid that it is actually true that I can fall off. Like, I would not put it against, like, I would not put it past this game that I can just jump off to my death. I don't know if I'm actually going the right way or if I'm like scaling up the the geometry. You can fall off. You can get stuck down there. Can I? <laughs> so you better watch out. Yeah, I just. <laughs> See this fear hunter voice in this. <laughs> God damn it, Phil. We beat it! We saw the credits. <laughs> Expand dog. Back to the wheel. Next game. Next game. Back to the wheel. Alright, fuck it. If you guys if you guys say so. We got the credits. We technically got an ending. All right, back to the wheel. That is stupid. <laughs> that is so fucking stupid. <laughs> All right, that is technically another game down. Man, you guys really want to see that tunnel, do you? 15% chance of Inunaki tunnel. All right. Whatever the fuck. Let's spin! <laughs> hey! Okay, good. Woo! I don't know what this one is. I just got it off of Steam. I, I, I don't, I have no idea what this one is. All right, let's hide the choice. Lucky Phil. We should probably get back to non-massacre after a while. <laughs> this game is called Lure. It's completely free on Steam, and I have no idea what, what it's about. It's about luring, I guess. Are you going- are you thinking of going back to Massacre? Yes. Uh, but <laughs> let's let's move on and see this first. Press space to begin. This is the road that homeless man directed me to. Should be a man who will pay well for me to fish at the abandoned Shinto shrine. This is Japanese. Oh my god, the mouse movement is crusty! You could put non mass uh, put massacre on the wheel after this game. I probably will. Hello. Good evening. Looking to make some extra scratch? Just take a rod and bring a me a fish from the lake surrounding the Shinto shrine behind the van. No strings attached? Question mark. As long as you ain't superstitious, then you should be fine. So go ahead. 
Thanks. I thought that was a gun for a second. What is this atmosphere? Doesn't look like anyone has been here in years. That's such a tiny little shrine. So do, I, do I just fish? A fish. Got a bite. Well, that was easy. I have to see the old man. Yeah, we're going fishing, boys. So we'll get the tunnel eventually. You don't know me. I have I have luck. Maybe maybe you won't ever see Inunaki Tunnel. Who knows? It's a complete gamble. Here's the fish. Now show me the cash. Hmm. Not so fast. Tell you what. Bring me two more fish, and you'll be rewarded generously. Fine. You better pay up when I come back, old man. I can't really sprint or jump, so... This is all that I can do at the moment. Got one! Got a bite. Got a way. To try fishing somewhere else. Remember, kids, when taking a job, always have a contract, or else this shit happens. Tigera is 100% right. Verbal contracts ain't worth for shit. When there's a jump scare in that tunnel game, Phil will die of a heart attack. Possibly. Oh, you suck at fishing, dude. Oh. Yeah, no, uh... Maybe fish over here? Oh! <laughs> Hello? What the fuck it- Oh! Kamiwa, Shinda. All right, that's the game. <laughs> that's lore. I have right, yeah, five minute game. Literally five minute game. Excellent, sick. Holy shit, we're burning through these fast. Also, I should put the non massacre back into the wheel. There we go, back into the wheel. All right, all right, all right. I guess you could say you were baited. The old man was a fucking asshole. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. I like how the, the wheel always starts at Inunaki Tunnel. Right. <laughs> hey! Delayed death for like one more game! Unsorted VHS. Right. I think this one is a bit longer than the other ones. I think this one's like around 30 minutes, 45 minutes. Uh, so... I, I, I've been wanting to play this one for a while, so... Let's see. Open that shit up! The thumbnail for this game is very, very cool. Of course it's also made in Unity! This might be just a Unity week, really. Warning! This game contains flashing uh, disturbing imagery. Sort of VHS. Credits.
I love that a lot of these games use freesound.org, the same website that I get the fucking FNAF Plus sound effects from. Wake up hanging from a ceiling. A box of VHS tapes sits in front of you. You pick up a tape. It softly quivers in your hand, the label reminding you of a distant memory. Suddenly, you hear a strange voice. Play the tapes. Find out how you got here. Everything is interlinked. Don't you remember? Eject tapes at any time with G? All right. <gasps> we can choose! Can I move out of this chair? No, I cannot. All right, chat. Which type should we go for? Not the bloody one. I think we we're gonna leave the bloody one for last. Uh, one, two, three, four. Which one of the? Which one should we do? One, two, three, four. Left to right. One, two, three, four. Second one. Four, three, two. First one probably. <laughs> no, no, no. The bloody one clearly. No, I think we're gonna leave that one for last. Uh, everyone's saying three. Or one. I'm gonna go with the third one. Alright, thank you, Yumineko chan. We are going with the third one. Cabin Anomaly Investor Briefing. Just insert this right in here. Ooh, unauthorized reproduction or distribution is illegal. The Cabin Ano Anomaly Investor Briefing. Nature of the Anomaly. Teleportation. Instantaneous travel between two locations without crossing the intervening space. This is analog horror as fuck! Holy shit! Unmarked location, a branch of the cam cabin anomaly. One of the six cabins seems to be missing. It is unknown how to enter it, as none of the other cabins teleport to it. Oh! Precisely traced symbol in the center of the cabins. The material is extraterrestrial. One part of the symbol seems to be pointing towards the unmarked location. It actually is analog horror. Well, all of them are. This is more like standard. This continues the investor briefing. All right. Cabin anomaly. All right, chat. One, two, four. Teleporting cabins. Got it. Definitely a robot. Said two. This is the looker. All right, definitely not a robot. Let's see what we got. I'm actually moving this one. Hmm. We're just walking around surveying this house, I guess. I don't want to go in here. Huh. Is my monitor just dirty or is there like a figure in the distance over there? I'm not sure. Oh, there's a massive fucking radio tower at the top of this? Why? Apparently doesn't look cursed at all, just an average house. Yeah, surely. Just 
interesting. What if we go into like the darkness? Or, like the the outskirts of this location. There is an invisible wall. Interesting. Are you the looker or are you the one being looked at? You definitely feel like I'm more the looker, if anything. We can eject the tapes at any time with G, so maybe we can try another one? Maybe it's, maybe it's like a puzzle where we have to do something in one tape? Alright, let's use this one, maybe? Mountain View Primary School. Oh. <laughs> no, I don't like that Outlast 2 shit. No, thank you. No. Oh, that's... Mm. Oh, that's terrifying. Okay. Activated. Oh, this is exactly the kind of shit for why I don't like tunnels. But in a school, which makes it worse! I have my fucking hand on the G button. Alice, do you want to go play at the cabins after school again? It's so fun, I just realized that you don't... ...hoof to the cabins that are already open. This will change the game of tag forever. No, that- that's a horrible idea. Okay, okay, yeah, yeah, there's nothing in the- in the darkness. Okay, good. Uh, so you don't teleport to the cat to the open cabins, got it. No, you- you don't teleport to the cabins that have the doors... Yeah, you don't. Where the fuck do you go then? Oh, this place fucking freaks me out. Yeah, I need to go. I need to go. I need to go. I can't handle that. No, okay. No, 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 no. Not that one. Oh. What is this one? Security room. Okay, this is building up some great atmosphere. This is the foundation from the third tape. The Scepter Foundation. Still can't sprint or anything. Yeah, I'm fascinated. Like, what the fuck is going on here? Oh, okay, that's a corpse. I, I, I didn't realize that was a corpse. Oh shit. Oh, this guy had was able to protect himself too. Insert disc. No, that disc is not available, buddy. Oh. There's something there. On the looker tape! Or is that supposed to be me? What's that noise? Right, I can't leave here. I really like where this is going. 
Okay, so this is to explain the teleporting cabins, and this is the looker. What the fuck is even going on here? It was behind in here. This is so fucking cool! It told me where the key was! Back, what are we playing? Uh, we're playing Unsorted VHS. This is such a cool fucking concept for a game. That's the key to the basement. Yeah, so the idea of this game is that it's like a one giant puzzle where you have like five tapes to watch. And each one interconnects with one another. And like one gives you hints uh, to, to solve the puzzle of the next tape. You have to like swap around. Fuck that, dude! Oh my god! God, why does it have to be tunnels every time? Okay. <laughs> I fucking. <laughs> Oh, I, I, I like, f I almost like threw my headphones out a window. Fuck. You're doing great, Phil. You think so? Shit, it's not here anymore. Oh my god. <laughs> it's incredible that every time there's a jump scare, Phil never gets scared except when it's in a tunnel. Yeah, you think? <laughs> Oh, that made me jump out! Fuck! God fucking damn it. Is it gonna happen again if I go again? It's not, okay. Oh my god, oh my god, no, please! <gasps> Oh no! This is so mean! This is so mean! Do I want to go like where the where the guy came from or Inunaki tunnel, but it's smaller. It almost makes it worse, honestly. Okay, we can't go over there. That's nice to know. Alright. 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 Why would you ever do this? 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 Oh, that's a computer. That's a bloody computer. Right click to zoom. Oh, this is perfect for a fucking jump scare, isn't it? This is perfect for a fucking jump scare. From Alfred Raphael to George Booker. Hey, George, I'm sending this to you from the looker in hope that it does not find me here. Oh, God, great. Put the cabin out lomily on full lockdown. Hell, if I were you, I would put the pulse sonar down. The high level security access code is 4142. 41. Okay, chat, please remember. 41. I don't want to come back here again. 4142. I know this is coming out of nowhere. I, I'm not the one authorized for this, but you have to trust me. I'll try to make my way to you. Okay. I don't want to turn around. Fuck it. <laughs> Fuck it. Fuck it. Yeah. Shh. Fuck. Fuck.
Fuck that. Fuck that. Fuck the looker tape. Okay. This is the security room. The cabin anomaly. Cabin anomaly investor briefing. Wait, did that motherfucker talk about the tapes as if they were places? All right. All right. I don't like the music that's playing in the, the room that I'm currently in. This game is freaking me the fuck out! Four two. What does that mean? It doesn't go off until it doesn't go off and yeah. Where the fuck do you put the code? Security room, maybe? We'll try that, but I didn't see any prompts for him. Alright, 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 alright. Hey, Domino Head! Thank you for your donation. Do I seriously have to go back to the looker again? Is that a sp is that smoke in the distance? This tape makes me feel safe. I know there's a like, I know there's a dead body on this one, but this one makes me feel safe because there's a shotgun in here. There's no place that I can insert the disc or anything from. Is this one just to tell me to go back to the looker? You can open the file cabinets. Thank you. Oh! <gasps> thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Baba. Thank you for not letting me go back to the looker. Holy shit. Thank you so much. There we go. Enter the access code to retrieve the override key. Uh, use the number keys to input the code. 4241. No. 4142. There we go. Overriding lockdown. What does that mean? <laughs> I thought I was safe in that one. If you think the looker tape is bad, just remember that the worst is on its way. Oh, great! Thank you, Viagra!
Okay. Uh, let's do that again and hopefully not fucking, like, slam our key down for the... I did not- that was such an obvious setup for a jump scare, I did- fuck. Oh my god, the fucking thing is not here. The thing is not here! The fucking thing is not here! Oh my god, that's so fucking genius! That is so genius! You can't do that again! Because it's already done! That's so good! Holy shit, that's so fucking good! Okay, now I'm gonna be paranoid of this window, like, all game. Okay, okay, okay! That's so fucking genius! These are not tapes at all, these are like, different worlds that I'm, like, jumping into. Does that mean that the lockdown of this is, like, lifted? This is so fucking good! <gasps> Bring your kid to work day. Scepter Foundation presents. Smart, intelligent people. Scepter Foundation are up to. Fuck them, kids. Hey. Jesus Christ. Did you hear that? Why did that beep again? Oh my fucking god. Fuck! Oh, the door's open. Of course. Of course there is. Of course it is! I'm not gonna go back there. I'm not gonna go back into the darkness. Fuck that. Fuck that. I can't even sprint. Can't even fucking sprint on this. Are you having fun? Kako, can you get here, please? I would very much appreciate having someone to help me calm, calm down at the moment. Because this shit is scary. Okay, got it. Thank you. Oh god. Do not play horror games while you're alone, or you're gonna fucking sh shit your pants. That's the place I'm in. That's the place I'm in. No, it's not, but it's the same background. It's the same... ...starry background. Am I, like, right there? Mark location. I am fucking terrified of what's going. Most of the financiers are simply not interested in the unmarked location, and if I'm being honest, it might not even exist. Our best option right now is to try to moving one of the cabins. It could prove to be a revolutionary way of transport. I assemble, I'll assemble a team for Tuesday. You want me to calm on? Oh, very much so. Please, Kako. Pl help me. <laughs> help me right now. Please. God. Cabins, aren't I? Ooh. Why <laughs> do you do that so fast, game?
please live him on his own, Kako. I want to see him suffer. Fuck! It seems more amusing to leave you alone! Fuck you! Ugh! Please be aware of the following guidelines when working with the cabin anomaly. Do not, under any circumstances, leave objects inside of the cabins. This can cause fatal injuries upon teleportation. Close the cabin's doors upon exiting them. This is to maintain the interior of the cabins. Failure to do so may damage the integrity of the anomaly. This is literally some SCP bullshit. Employees must conduct teleportation research one at a time. See guideline number one. Failure to follow these, these guidelines will result in contract termination. Okay, do we actually have to follow these rules? Don't leave objects inside of the cabins. Close the cabin doors upon exiting them. Employees must conduct research at one, of, one at a time. Okay. This is where the other cabin was that, like, got disappeared. Because we're gonna have to actually go try these out. They don't fucking work? Wait. This is the left... This is the left one. Why are there so many peepees on the chat? Oh, it totally fucking works. Got it. That is cool, actually. It's a cool mechanic. <laughs> you aren't alone. You have pee pee, Phil. Aww, thank you. That's nice, actually. <laughs> That's kind of heartwarming. Thank you. I have pee pee with me. Pee pee's not gonna help protect me, though. If anything, pee pee's gonna laugh at me for pissing my pants, but I appreciate that. These are these are fucking cool. Teleportation. That's nice. Let me guess. I have to go follow this wire down here. I don't think so. There is a... There is an invisible wall preventing me to go outside, so... Maybe we need to prevent one of the... Maybe we need to break one of the rules to continue. Huh. Yes, but it's a laugh you can listen to warmly. That's a nice thought. What's gonna happen if I hit G now? <gasps> Wait a second! Maybe if I go into one of the cabins and I press G and leave this, like, tape. Oh wait, I can Yeah, I right, I can I can leave one of these open. Open all doors and then go to one. Maybe that'll lead into the sixth one. That sounds like it'll lead into my death, but maybe. This sounds like it's going to lead into a nightmare. This sounds like it's going to lead re into really bad places. 
You know when your mom tells you to like, don't fucking touch the stove, idiot. Don't fucking place your hand on the stove while it's on, idiot, because you're gonna burn your hands, you fucking dumbass, don't do it. And then you do it because you're a stupid asshole and you burn your hand and they have to cut it off. Yeah, we're doing that now. We're doing this now. All right. Fuck it. I've never been so terrified of opening a door in my fucking life. Yeah! I guess we found the six cabin! Good job. Fuck! It's just gone, isn't it? That shit is just gone. tower. Holy Jesus fucking Christ, what is even going on anymore? Have fun in the wet room. Yeah, this is very wet. Run! There- There is no run button. <laughs> this game is amazing! Hell, I guess. That's us. Oh, no. I don't want to press G. Contents of these tapes are very familiar. They remind you of a place similar to this one. But how do you expect to return? I don't want to press G. You want them to watch them over and over again. The friction between the VCR head and the tape wears out the plastic. They grow brittle and eventually break. All that's left are distant memories. Created by Mike Club Nick Club Nicola. Thank you for playing. Holy shit! <laughs> Fucking awesome! I love it. Oh, that was awesome. That's that might that might be the fucking like feature of the night. Cool. All right. Fucking unsorted VHS. That was unexpectedly amazing. You did it. All right. Uh next on the list is 1 2 3 4 5. We have Inunaki Tunnel. We have Nun Massacre, we have The Building 71 Incident, we have Scary Tales Volume 1, and we have No Players Online. <sighs> right. One out of five. Can we do it? No 
players online. Oh, okay, good. Oh. All right. I mean, maybe. There's only it's only been an hour. It's only been like two hours. Maybe I'll come back to this. We still have non massacre to play, so maybe. Maybe we'll return to this after no players online. I heard that one, that game was good. I'm too lucky. All right. What was no players online? You find a dusty VHS tape with footage of an old video game. Every single one of these is fucking... What the fuck? Every single one of these is... Oh no! That is stupid. Now. This game refuses to move to my second monitor. There we go. Behind the scenes. Nah, it's all good. You're just seeing my fucking stream setup. There's literally nothing in here. All right. This is kind of th this is the point. This is the issue with some fucking Unity games that they fucking show uh, that they don't let you move stuff to the second monitor. I will probably, whenever I get like third monitor for the stream, I'm probably gonna have to how, how you how you fucking call it. I'm probably gonna have to uh, get a third monitor specifically for these types of games. All right, what is this? CTF official server one, two, three. Uh, just press enter. Shit. Come on, game. Game. There we go. Hello, everyone. Let's go for official CTF server number one. It reminds me of the server browser from TF2. To be honest, two monitors should be good enough. Yeah, I guess, but... Why can't I use my mouse? Okay, this game does funky stuff. Why is my mouse in the middle of the screen? What the fuck is wrong with this game? Hold on. There we go. The Unity moment. Score is zero out of three. Looking for players. Yeah, whenever I click on this game, it just completely stops focusing on the application. That's weird. Did I die? No. What is this? A Quake multiplayer ripoff? I think it actually, that's the point. Yes. What is this game? I just joined the stream? Question mark? Welcome to No Players Online. We're playing a fucking dead Quake MMO thing. It's not an MMO, it's a fucking multiplayer shooter. This is what's going to happen to TF2 in uh, about 10 years. Hopefully not, but still. Oh, I've seen this game before. Ra uh, really cool stuff. Why would you put this in a multiplayer FPS?
fun fact about TF2, uh, Scout is canonically a pedophile. Yeah, it's in the item description of one of his costumes. Oh. You fuckers see that? Is this, one of, is this gonna be one of these games where, like, a fucking, like, spooky... Spooky boy jump scares me from, like, from a distance? You should shoot the record player. Do it for the funny. Uh, I can't. Uh, whenever I click left mouse click, like, my, my view gets completely, uh, defocused on the application. That's some evil shit. <laughs> there was fucking nothing. That's cute. Oh, the spooky boy joined the game. What is he, what's he gonna do? Oh, the spooky boy. <laughs> Okay, this is kind of lame. Compared to unsorted VHS. Oh, the spooky boy's gonna get me! <laughs> it's just a PNG of a guy. Oh, the door is open now. There's nothing. Oh, he gonna get me! Oh, he gonna get me! I can't shoot him! Ah! Oh, the, 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 oh, 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 oh. Memes. He just wants to play. He's a lonely little gamer. <laughs> Spooky Shadow Monster. Yeah, this is a nice little break from unsorted VHS. Like, that game wanted, like, made me want to fucking, like, claw my eyes out. This is just dumb. Run away! Plot twist, it's just some 12 year old boy who wants to, wants to pick the mic up. Oh boy. Why the fuck would you put like a random record, record player in the middle of your, like your multiplayer map? Behind you! Oh, the spoopy boy behind me! Oh, he gonna give me! Oh, the spooky boy gonna give me! He coming! Excuse me, sir, do you like to trade some hats? So what you're doing, do not move another step. Whatever you don't, do not deliver that flag. How did you even get access to this game? Can you hear me? Excuse me, sir, would you like to trade some hats? You can read this, press Y to chat and say something. I cannot. Wait, never mind, I don't think you have chat permission on the server. Just shoot twice if you can read this. I can't actually shoot! I can't actually shoot, my dude! The game prevents me from shooting. Like, the, the game actually prevents me from shooting, I'm, I am very sorry. Am I soft locked? Press R. No, that's no. I, it's not because I don't have ammo. It's because the game prevents me from shooting. I'm just gonna deliver the flag. Fuck it. Stop what you're doing. No. I did it. Eat my ass. Kick from server. Reason, connection to host lost. Alright. Okay! Well, I couldn't really... do the primary mechanic of that game, so... that's a shame. He <laughs> rage quitted. The mods didn't like that you won, so they kicked you out of the server. <laughs>
Is that is that just because I like started the game wrong, or is there like an actual issue? Hold on. Made with Unity. Isn't that game an I R R R R A R G? No. Maybe? Who knows? Capture the flag project. Oh, I legitimately can't do anything. Oh. It, it just quit. It just absolutely quit me out of the game. You can't play again. All right. Well, I guess that's fucking no, pl no players online. Whatever. Uh, let's try another game out, because that was kind of short, honestly. Hey, Nick, uh, we technically already beat the goal for the for the stream. Because I already fucking got all the games that I wanted to do. But let's be honest here, we still need to try one more time. Uh, wanna... Want to try out, uh, your luck? 25% chance? Tunnel, tunnel, tunnel? Tunnel, tunnel, tunnel? I think the people want the tunnel. Just play the tunnel game, shake my head. What do you mean 33% chance? This is, a uh, four... This is four. Uh... This is one out of four. That's 25% chance. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. <gasps> there we go. Fuck. <laughs> Whatever, let's go. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Yo, Nick. Kako. Anybody? Would you? Would you? Would you? Can, can, can I get a little assistance over here? Cause I'm not gonna be able to talk much for this. I might need a little bit of assistance. I ran out of luck. Yes, I pushed my luck. Hey! <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Holy shit, well, Nick. Thank you. Person. Yeah, okay. Alright. Holy fuck. At least I have Nick with me for this. Do you know, do you know about my, my thing with Inunaki Tunnel? I know, yeah, you kind of, uh, closed the game after, like, a few minutes. Of playing it, yes. Yep. Alright, uh, Kako originally gifted me this, and it, it fucking I know. freaked me out so badly, I uninstalled it and tried to, like, refund it, but I couldn't because he gifted me the thing, so... Shit. What up, new man? <laughs> Come on, Daves, he's not a new man. <laughs> Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Let's try out Inunaki Tunnel again. <sighs> oh boy. I need to share the screen with you. Yep. Just I need to move the game to a different window. About this game, so this is, I don't know. I don't know anything about this. I don't know anything about this. But the but the effects and shit for it are like really cool. Okay. There we go, chat. <sighs> Inunaki tunnel. I'm gonna- I'm gonna try to get into the right headspace. I'm gonna try to, like, 
felt my courage for this. Tonight is the night. I have to do this. It's the only way I'd ever get famous. WASD. Action. Option. Wow, the, the, the game is actually very quite intensive on my PC for some reason. I'll turn that master volume down, thank you. Uh, Q to drop, F for flashlight, shift to sprint, left mouse for action, zoom right mouse. Holy shit, why is this so laggy on the stream? Is it because I'm screen sharing this? Oh great, Nick muted himself. That's great. Oh great. Fuck. Yeah, it is fucking laggy. Why why of all things does this game have issues with streaming? Exit? Yeah, fuck it. Chickens out! Yeah, that's not how it's gonna work, is it? If I was the protagonist of this, I would have chickened out. Game can get that loud. This is gonna be a problem. I guess you guys are gonna have to get used to 20 FPS for this. Shit. Or maybe if I change it to this. No, that makes it even worse. Hey, that's plenty. Alright, I guess my PC is not powerful enough to run Inunaki Tunnel. Is is the game lagging? Ugh, why? You need to buy an, a better PC, I guess. I do need to install that GPU that... Ugh. Camcorder may activate its face detection or anything with a strong spiritual energy. Actually, yeah, uh, I, have a, I have a way to fix this. I think I have a way to fix this. Hold on. Hold on. <laughs> yeah, we're, we're gonna stall for a little bit. I think I have a way to fix this. Uh, graphics quality. Uh, there we go, just change it to that one. <sighs> Why are you gonna be here if you're not gonna talk? <laughs> have some uh, noise in the background. Fuck. I, I'm not gonna talk as much. Right. So, yeah. It fixed it! Oh, that's good. Holy shit, thank god. I thought that it, <laughs> the, the people on the stream were gonna have to be, like, be subjected to like fucking 20 FPS. What did you even do? I just turned out the resolution of the game. It doesn't even oh. look that different. <laughs> It doesn't. Right. Would you at least want to explain to the people on the chat why I'm so fucking terrified of tunnels again? Uh, again? Please. Well, so, um, basically, Phil had, um, 
quite experienced uh, when he was young and it was related to tunnels so now he's yeah I know I'm low I'm I'm talking low that's the thing um, but yeah uh, something happened with the tunnel he tried to go into a tunnel and something ended up chasing him I think yep I think it was like a dog um, or like two people not sure you'll which never know. you'll never know the fact that I, n I will never know is the thing that haunts me why is this doll here Thing is, the reason for why I'm so afraid of this particular game is because this tunnel looks exactly like the one that I went to when I was a kid. Right. Like, pretty much, like... Dead on exactly. Oh, well, man up, I guess. And I don't know what's gonna happen. Go in. Go in. It's okay. Um, open your eyes, please. <laughs> God damn it. Did I get soft locked? <laughs> <laughs> Don't tell me I got soft locked. Don't you fucking dare. <laughs> No, 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 no. <laughs> God fucking damn it. <laughs> How do you even manage to do this? Stop making excuses, Phil. Face your fears. No, these are not excuses. <laughs> I want to move. Can you like exit the game? <laughs> okay. Fuck! <laughs> All right, that took the scariness out a little bit on it. Ooh. That means you don't need me. I like no. Stay here. <laughs> <laughs> At least I can talk to someone. <laughs> Maybe. Phil's just dragging this out because he's too scared. I might have tried to, like, drag it out at the start, but now, like, <laughs> I did not expect to get softlocked. Alright. I've never seen past that, too. Like, that's it. That's that's all that I've played. Well, no, I, I do know that you have to move on a little bit more, but... It's, like, half an hour long, I think. Is it?! Around that, yeah. A little bit longer. <laughs> now you have to play with your eyes open. So that I don't get I'm soft locked? Even... Yeah, bitch. Ugh. your eyes open your eyes no. open up you're gonna get soft luck again where do i even go <laughs> stop uh, laughing i can't <laughs> i can't <laughs> fucking god this is the worst this is like the um <gasps> arthur thing from the joker movie where you laugh and you cannot help it. Uh, <laughs> a little bit. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Do it. I Go on. It. Go on. Well, what the fuck's gonna happen if I go there? Yeah, I don't know. Shall I mute myself? Please don't. <laughs> okay, then open your eyes. All right, I have the moment. What do you want me to do? Hate this. <gasps> Too bad. Oh, 
god. I literally this is literally fear. this is literally all that happened with Kako. Like Kako told me to play this and then I did I got to here and I just fucking couldn't. Yeah. Uh, uh I hate that it lo it's it looks exactly like the one in the fucking camp. <laughs> Oh, um, stop screen sharing. Hello? Right. Thank you. No problem. Now open your eyes. What even is that? I don't know where to go. I don't know where to go. It's... Right, at least I'm in the light now. Oh. Uh. Uh. <laughs> this is like a fucking nightmare. <laughs> the fuck is that? Good boy. What is that? I don't know. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Did you see that? <laughs> uh, no, I did not see anything. Shut the fuck up. No, you didn't. Shut up. Oh god, what is this? Oh, it's a car? Oh. Uh, I've never gone past this. Now's the chance. I don't want to turn a corner. I didn't even look that, that scary. The fuck? That looks so fucking scary! What do you mean? No. Oh, can I sprint? I, uh, I don't want to sprint. I don't want to sprint. I don't get it. Oh, Jesus fucking Christ. Is this the outside? <gasps> That's a light. Move. Oh, oh, I'm, I'm up. I'm on the outside. Okay. Okay. You can do Fuck it. Fuck that shit. Oh. Wait, I, I saw something behind you. Oh. Guess it wasn't anything. Just to clear up the path. E. Go back. You need to. <laughs> so, be careful, because I, I, I swear I saw something. I don't know what it is. You're absolutely doing this to fuck with me. And you know what? It's fucking working. Where the fuck am I gonna have to find a key on there? Maybe, maybe I don't need to. Maybe I, I need to, like, find it over here. Need to craft it. Oh! <laughs> Thank you, Crash. Jesus Christ. Phil, you can do this. I believe in you. Is that a fucking shrine entrance? Oh, oh my god, I can't- I, I don't have- I don't need to go to the tunnel! I can go here! Oh my god, thank god! Oh! It's- it's... Oh! Okay! Thank you, Crash. This is still not any better, but... Don't talk too soon, I guess. Wait, 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 wait. What is that? It was a mistake, <laughs> asking you to be here. <laughs> <laughs> oh! Oh, that's what it was. Ew. Look at this, look at this PS2 dude. Does he have a key? He's just hanging out. Literally. 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 Yeah. 
know what this gives me vibes of? Ever heard mm. of uh, Siren the Blood Curse? No. Looks like something used to be here. Oh, shit! Is this where the doll was supposed to be? Fuck. Pull the ring. Ah, oh, fucking hell, <laughs> fiddle oil crash. Bob the Builder, we can't fix it. What was that all about? Thank you, thank you, Crash. What was that all about? What did I get? I have no idea. It was just... Why does it look so flat? Is it like a... It's a texture, texture? yes. Yeah. Maybe you need to go back. I don't want to go back. I want to explore every single inch of this place to find the, the item that I need. Shit, I need the I need the fucking doll, don't I? God fucking damn it. Oh. Wait. The fuck? What did I get? Oh, that's the doll. Or a rock. The dog at Shira Ishii's house seems to be attracted to the sacred stone. The dog will chase down anyone who approaches the stone, and even... And one even came back with his calf muscle completely pulled apart. Even when Shira Ishii tried to put it on a chained leash, it always manages to break it. I'm gonna get chased- I'm gonna- Am I gonna get chased down by a fucking dog? That is... Scarily appropriate, actually, to the story. Toby Fox and the ar Artifact. Fuck. That's actually literally a photo of a statue stretched out over a mesh. Look! Look on the sides. This is straight up like a photo of a statue in the real life. Done. Yeah, I get the job done. There was an earthquake. Does that mean that the path is open? This game is personalized to Phil! Maybe it's closed. Please tell me that didn't open the path. I am sprinting, by the way. Are you? We're fucked. We're not going back there. You know? Since there's no more tunnels, I Yay! might as well um, leave the call. Oh, but you, we were having fun. It's okay if you if you if you want to go though. It's okay. <laughs> I I am I am pretty I am feeling pretty good though I I thought that I needed to go do another tunnel section I'm kind of glad that no. I don't actually Who knows actually I'm gonna check real quick yeah the 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 tunnel got caved in I literally can't go back there anymore though I do That's need to lame. find I still have I I'll still need to find a key why is it called Inunaki Tunnel though well we did just go through a tunnel. Where the fuck is the key, though? Oh, thank god. I guess the worst part of this game was, like, at the very start. Holy shit. Thank god. I'm relieved, honestly. Oh! There, there is more tunnels. There we go, the man. There we go, there's the key. We're going back to the tunnel, boys! We go back to it! 
of course, of course it w this would happen. Like, why did I expect that things were gonna get any better? Reposo, fuck. Don't get too excited just yet. There's probably gonna be a time where you have to go back to the tunnel. And that time, my friend... ...is now. back to hell. And you know, this one is a worse tunnel, because we already got the backstory of a dog. I hate it. I hate it. <sighs> okay, now you just made it better, actually. Uh, thank you. <laughs> uh, I'm spooky monster. What is actually gonna be the threat here, or, or or is it just not gonna be a threat at all? It's just gonna be a game that's literally just a tunnel. Uh, no. God, no. taking us taking every step of this is like fucking torture. <laughs> It's fine. It really is. It's a video game. It's so quiet too. Like anything could jump out at any moment. <laughs> Boogaboo! Thank you, Crash. Ah! <laughs> okay. R is he left. Scary. Okay. <laughs> Booga booga. Alright, so that car was, uh, haunted, I guess. Why is everything burnt? Matsuda isn't thinking well about, about the dog at Chiraishi's. Chiraishi is thinking about expanding the land, but the sacred stone seems to be on the way. Matsuda knew that the dog will get in the way of anyone that will try to remove the stone. He tried talking to Shiraishi persistently, but the dog loved his, but he loved his dog so much that he refused to listen to Matsuda. Yeah, the the dog, the dog's gonna be the the, the fucking thing. Evil dog. Evil dog. I guess that's why it's called the Inu Naki. Inu Naki tunnel. Yeah, Inu dog. In mm. Japanese. Fox Naki. In weeb shed. What is Naki exactly? Nothing good. Just fucking go, just fucking go, just sprint, just fucking go, just get me out of here, get me out of this nightmare, get me out of this nightmare. Oh, it's like crying dog. Get tunnel. me, get it, get me out of this like fucking that. nightmare, please! Okay, good! <sighs> We're out of here! Saito 1987. Obayashi 1942. Nakamura 1966. Like something used to be here. Yeah, I can fix him? Don't tell me I have to go back for the other fuck. for the. for the statue. How's the game called? Inunaki Tunnels. Yeah. What does that mean then? Tunnels. Yeah. Wouldn't it be fucking lame if it didn't have any more tunnels halfway through? The first person here drowned by the hour. The last person was burned alive by the minute. First person here drowned by the hour. Person. Oh, you need to check the tombstones. By date. June eight. Oh, this is a puzzle. Oh, yeah. What the nabe in nineteen fifty six. Uh, Nick, let Phil have some peace. Holy oh, shit! 
Maybe he does. I am pretty. Need some peace. I, I'm pretty. I'm pretty good right now, actually. Like I'm. Oh, that's good. Uh, as long as I'm not inside one of those fucking things, I'm good. Yeah, good. I don't really know why I need to put these things here, but whatever. What's the puzzle gonna be like? Yeah, this does very much remind me of, like, Siren the Blood Curse. Ito, 1940. That's the earliest one yet. Oh god, and what is what the fuck? Oh, that's kind of spooky. That's a guy. You're standing there. Right. Right, Mr. M Mr. M Mr. Man. Tanaka, nineteen fifty fifty nine. Recently, Shiraishi's dog started barking more aggressively and persistently. Matsuda had decided to move the stone on his own. When Matsuda tried to finally remove the stone, the dog barked and would not stop. Matsuda was unable to hold his anger and stabbed the dog multiple times with a spear. Hearing the dog cry was unbearable. Oh, Inunaki! When Shiraishi found his dog was gone, he was filled with rage. Matsuda moved the stone regardless. Takahashi, 1970s. Tanaka, 1950. First person here drowned by the hour. The last person was buried alive by the minute. Edit the clock. How do I know which one is which? I have no idea. Everyone crying for the doggo? Hey, that doggo is evil. I think. No. No, the dog is crying. Because they moved the stone. This is actually kind of lame. <laughs> actually. Well, at least I'm not in the tunnel. Yamamoto... Uh, 1974. Yeah, that's not working, idiot. Uh, I'm not trying to. Nakamura, 1966. Uh, a boy, some. Obayashi, 1942. Saito, 1987. Where do. Which one do I do? Hmm. Can you check on, on the on the video that you searched, please? I don't think I want to. Oh. The dude. Yeah, okay, this is deflating the tension a lot. Holy shit. That's great. I can um, finally conquer my fears of this stupid fucking okay, game. Okay, okay, okay. So, from what I'm seeing, um, go to the clock. Clock time. Yeah. If it's the same for every playthrough. Maybe. Yeah. Uh, so, set the minute uh, thingy. On the 12. Yeah, and now set the hour thingy on 4. Hey! I don't know how that makes sense, but thank you! Dun, 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 dun. Let me guess, the man is going to be gone. Ooh, I fucking knew it. What is that? You 
You need to make a call. Fucking don't scratch your neck, motherfucker. <laughs> I get it, because it feels a fucking weave. How do I help you? Uh, crouch. Oh. There's something in there. I cannot crouch. What uh, are saying FNAF? One, two, three, four, something. Can I actually crouch? I cannot. Can you get out? I cannot. The mass. But I soft luck myself. Yeah. Oh! You good? <laughs> okay. I'm not sure. Okay, keep going there, then. Keep going. Oi. Do you have room for one more, Keko says. Sure, fuck it, let's make this a party. Can you add him to the call, please? Okay. Give me a sec. Um, go. Hey, friends! Enjoying the game, buddy? It's actually way less scary than I thought, which holy sh fucking shit, thank god. Yeah, it took you like two fucking years, Jesus It Christ. took me two years to play this, because the start was so fucking scary! Holy shit. There's something in the van. The door is stuck. What is this? Beans on toast is nasty. I That's a fucking axe! Shit. Grab the axe. It seems to be stuck. Open the door. Well, I can't. I need to go find something. Open the door. I can't see fucking anything right now. Is that a river? Sometimes sometime we need Kako, Nick, Kelly, and Kane at the one time, but why Kane? Kane is not like a co-host. It's like a I guess. dude that appears sometimes, but yeah. Well, right now I'm going through a forest, which is like way better. Kane is way too busy. Doing like important shit. Like what? Mouse Making fan games? games? Yes. Busy, actually, <laughs> but guess what? I'm back. Welcome, Bisco. Welcome back. I don't know why, but this is way more relaxing than I thought it was going to be. Hell yeah. I, I can't... This is more of an open area. This isn't, this isn't a tunnel. It is pretty fucking dark, though. I can't How's believe the... that unsorted oh, VHS scared me more Phil. than this. Phil. What? Phil, you're not screen sharing because, you know... Right, 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 right. Oh god, you hype this up for like two or three years and then you just play it and you're like, yeah, whatever. <laughs> I can't believe that on sort of VHS freaked me out more. Fucking bitch. Bitch. I have a I have a weapon now. I can kill people with this. Kill the dog. I don't want to kill the dog. Kill the dog. Maybe the dog is friendly. It's gonna cry. Eat your liver. The crying dog tunnel. I really this like the atmosphere, though. Yeah, it is. It's a nice atmosphere, but n not as scary as I thought it was gonna be. Mm, very good. pleasant. Why and are trees in a tunnel? I'm getting Three lost. Just games with the Japanese. Um, Vibe. This was the and... guy that made uh, no, all, the, all the apartment games. game. Yeah, they're not that scary. I do like the textures are like made using like actual photos this guy took. Every single texture is a photo. Nothing is like painted. It's like all like a photo mash of like stuff.
Thank God this guy kept the axe. Mm. Where are we even supposed to be going, anyway? The crying dog. It's, it's the one from RE4 Remake. There's a dog. Kill it. Kill it with the axe. Yeah. Okay. <gasps> this atmosphere is still pretty nerve-wracking, though. Okay, yeah, yeah, we literally just... There's no tunnel anymore. C congratulations, turns out your phobias... ...are not founded on anything like... Oh, we need to find another statue. This game is kind of boring <laughs> to look at. Let's see. Um. I don't know what this is. Yeah, it turns out your fears were nothing. Yay! I'm happy! <laughs> Holy shit! Turns out you're a fucking bitch. It's missing. It's rope, crank, and a bucket. Yeah, this is just a puzzle game. Just move around different areas where uh, fi finding puzzles. Hell yeah! We're really not living up to the hype. A hundred percent happy with this. Press Q to drop item. Don't you like being scared? Yeah. But I also like not feeling like I'm gonna die. What is this? Candles. Oh, does this, this fucking shrine burn down? It's so dingy. It's great. Uh, it's a great Buddhist bell. It seems to be missing the log used to ring it. There you go. Ring the bell? Yes. Next time, chat, make him play Forgotten Tunnels. I don't know what that is. I got the crank. Yeah, this is just a little puzzle game. Just go find the items and put them on the on the things. Uh, I don't know what happened, but now, but now before me, all I see is a desolated village with black clouds above us. Many known faces have fallen. I'm alive with blood coming out of my feet. I must record this before it's too late. It is getting darker and darker. My vision is hazy. But isn't that where Matsuda killed the dog? I see a silhouette in the darkness. Is that human? No. That is... Inunaki. The rope. All right, I need to go drop off the crank at the well, and I need to go get the rope. Holy shit, this was so... <laughs> this, this changed into a completely different experience, like 10 minutes after I went through the first tunnel. Uh, the crank in. Ding! The fuck are you doing, Kako? <laughs> What are you doing? I just I just noticed it. What the fuck, man? Get the bucket. The it's fact wrong, that buddy. the fact that you guys can put <laughs> can put anything. I, I'm placing way too much trust on you, but by knowing that you guys can put fucking anything on those. <laughs> what did you not notice? <laughs> Fuck you. That's what you to continue playing. Alright. I need to... Oh, fuck. Why can't I go back there? But I wanted the rope! Too bad. Do I need to turn... Do I need to, like, lit up those candles? Can I go th around this? Ow. Ow, my fucking ears. Yeah, okay, fine. I'll go lit up those candles. Somehow. Do it. Oh, I was going up here, not not in there. There we go. Hey Nikki! How we doing? 
Welcome to the Inunaki Tunnel stream. Was well, something way different than I originally thought. <laughs> but I think it's a good way to cap off this stream. Is he going to do something based? Soft locked incoming. Finally! There we go. He's winning. I'm winning. Let's just put these I here. Think, I don't think you needed us here, honestly. <laughs> yeah, for like a... Well, I, I needed you guys for like a minute at the very start. But yeah, it's nice to hang out with you. Yeah, because you were like shitting yourself. <laughs> A little like, bit. Okay, oh my god, I'm, I'm gonna be in the tunnel. Oh no. A little a little poop coming out of my butt for like a little bit. A little poopy butt. Yeah, yeah. But that's just fine. There was a like, like did, there was like a man near the phone booth and that's about it. Did you ever tell your chat the poop cookie story? What are you talking oh. about? <laughs> what is the poop cookie? Story. Hey! Welcome back, old friend. Oh look, a tunnel. Finally, the tunnel. I don't know. I think I, I think um, I'm not I that go. bothered by it anymore. Cause yeah. Do you know what will be funny? What? Oh <laughs> god, <laughs> fucking damn it! Don't don't you don't! It's not a, it's a dumb fucking game with dumb fucking tunnels. It's a fucking... Who gives a shit? This thing is not even fucking scary. It's not even scary anymore. Like, who gives a shit about the fucking... Stupid, dumb tunnel bullshit? It's not even fucking scary. Call the police? Yes! Police should come any minute now. Fucking great. No, wait for them. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Okay, it was a dog! <laughs> it was a dog! Motherfuckers! Doggy. Why did you come back at the exact same time? This is funny. Ah. Uh... Look at that dead girl. I love dead people. Wait. Is the game over? I think the game's over. Yeah, he won. That girl's just standing there. <sighs> Unless I finally fucking, like, got off my ass and actually played this game. Yeah, I guess I got my money's worth now. You did gift me this. How, Pretty how, sure I bought it. How much did you- It was like, it was like two bucks or like 79 pence, I remember. Jesus. I don't know if it's worth that much. Probably not. Uh... It, was, it was funny though. Oh. And Admiya Yakafuku was something something who goes by the name of Horror KG on a popular video streaming website. Shin Oga was reported. Missing on the night of October 27th! This is the 30th, but fair enough. Oh, it would have been funny if you played this on the 27th. Yeah, I guess. The police Wrong was point. initially called by Fujio using the emergency uh, roadside telephone near the entrance to of Inunaki Pass, but on arrival there was no one there but a broken camcorder left on the ground. Maybe he shouldn't have gone out on his they own. They were way. unable to recover the Maybe. files and the camera and assumed he was in the middle of recording his video on said website and look, looks to further investigate the area. 
Local government plans to block the tunnels completely and add security cameras to ward off future trespassers. Good ending. You got this the good still ending! Won. You still died though, so that's your fault. Yeah, you suck. Recording failed! Alright. I guess there's a good ending if you get all the statues put on th onto the stone pillars, but... I don't yeah. give a fuck. I think you're just too much of a pussy to do it. And the game crashed! <laughs> Amazing. The game fucking crashed! <laughs> That's a cool reference. When I was trying to fucking escape the fucking game, it crashed! <laughs> See, the best games crash. See, it wasn't that bad. Eh, it wasn't actually that bad. You know what? Uncertain VHS was way scarier on at the at, in the middle of the stream. Mm -hmm. Uncertain VHS was way oh, yeah, scarier. The, the, the school uh, tunnel. Inunaki tunnel. Alright. How have you been scared of that for like two years? I've been hell. I've been scared of playing that game for two years, and you know what? It it, I I right. was completely it's... wrong. That shit, that, that shit, that shit had a really good atmosphere at the start, but then it was just d puzzles and whatever the fuck. Oh well, I at least, I, them, I at I least finished this. Image I need to share with you. What do you need to share, buddy? What do you need to share, buddy? It's very, very important. It's, it's sending. It's very important. What do you, what do you need to send, buddy? It's this is a very the, important image. That's. I'm not gonna show that on stream. That's disgusting. Fuck you. How dare? Uh, what? Why? <laughs> Him. Why is that raccoon filled with milk? <laughs> it's soap. He's, he's getting clean. Alright! Thank you everybody for coming. I finally faced my nightmares. Turns out, uh, whatever your phobias tell you is scary, it a isn't actually. <laughs> or I guess uh, all the, the game's promises of being scary aren't actually true. Holy shit, mm -hmm. Uncertain VHS was good. Did you see that, Kako? When I, when I was playing uh... this game? I, I joined halfway through, I was really sleepy. It was super good. Oh, and anyways, uh, thank you, Nick. Thank you, Kako, for coming to the stream. Uh, no problem. I'll see yeah. you. I'll see uh, Kako. Kako, you're going to be there for tomorrow's mystery game? Yeah, I can't wait. Yeah! I know that enthusiasm. All right. Yeah, it's going to be the best game ever. I'll, see, to I'll see you guys tomorrow for the mystery game. Who yeah. knows what that could be? And bye bye. Gonna put the some music on. Bye oh. bye. Ah. I don't know if anybody can tell, but I really love this music.